and welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4 as the Free American Empire. I'm about to quit training troops in Missouri if they're going to pop up on my E. Anyways, let's get this rolling. We are in the middle of a war with Cuba. And Germany has capitulated. That's the new Germany. West Germany, East Germany... East Germany has joined the common turn. It's going to be interesting. Italy's still fighting a good fight. They're not doing too well, but they're still fighting. Cuba has capitulated. We're going to take all the states. Welcome to the state of Cuba within the Free American Empire. Next on our list is Mexico. And we gave Pat those five uh, Mountaineer divisions. Sadly, we don't have any tank divisions for him yet. So let's give Griswold a job. Your Marines, Griswold. We'll do an invasion here. To there. And when you're ready, make it happen. Patch. Six of your divisions will do an invasion. Shit. Try this again. Six of your divisions will do an invasion from here. And when you're ready, make it happen. And we have no national focus. We need to get busy on the Manhattan Project. And still no armor. Damn. That was Essex class. Midway class would be 200 days. We will pass on that for now. What's Cleveland class? I was going to build some light cruisers, but I didn't want to build older ones. So I didn't. No, 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 that's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Start training those guys. And it is now 41. Increase our efficiency cap. That took care of our chromium problem.
Let's start justifying against Mexico. Uh oh. China has capitulated. 160 days? That's insane. How am I going to be an aggressive fascist nation if I have to wait 160 days before I can attack my neighbor? That sounded wrong. And I don't care. Could have sent some guys down the Panama Canal zone and then attack to take out Panama. That'd be an easy battle to win. It's not 42 yet. Land doctrine. We're not working with enough land doctrine. West Germany joins the Allies. Whoop de doo. Wait a minute. Let me see that again. the hell do I create a faction? I forgot. I've done it before. I just don't remember how I did it. Don't remember how I created a faction before. I'm thinking, once I remember how to do it, I'm thinking about calling myself the New World Order because what the hell? I'm full of sarcasm. Since Patton's got mountain infantry, let's go ahead and spend some effort to give him a little extra oomph. Mexican War is going to be uglier. Definitely. More planes. More ground support.
this is how drastically different my strategy is. I'm not fortifying the islands in the Pacific. I'm worried about the allies on my coast. That's what you call a different strategy right there. Take a look at this. Should be the bulk of Patton's forces. I want to give his mountaineers. Oh Lord, mountaineers that need help. That's all I can do right now. What is he waiting on? Thirty-six tanks. Just go with that one. He's waiting on a lot of tanks. Okay, that one can wait. Finland joins the Allies. Soviet war declared war on Finland? That should put the Allies in conflict with the Soviet Union. It should. We got unassigned division. Get to training. Where in the hell are they at? Okay. Go to Louisiana. You are attached to Griswold. So go down there. You guys are attached to Patch. So get down there. No. I want you to get. Because you're in the wrong zone. Dumbass. Those five, I'm going to attach a new army. Italy has capitulated. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yep. Soviet Union is at war with Britain. Well, as long as they're fighting each other, I'll fight the winner. I don't like this taking forever to declare war. Because once you start doing multiple justifications, you're just multiplying the time it takes anyways. I'll show you what I mean. Let's just say I want to attack Panama. West Germany has capitulated. I start justifying against Panama. It takes 185 days.
I'm not sure if that thunder is in the game or outside. I apologize for that if it is out. Well, I can't apologize for it. I have no control over the weather. Kiss my ass. Can you feel the love, people? <laughs> All right, that's definitely here. Got the air cobra. Ah, electronic support te technology, support artillery, and support technology. I don't want to work towards those yet. Convoy tactics, then. Forty one. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's more like it. Let's start working on our nukes. They definitely need to learn to respect our authority or authorita. Start with the air cobra. Plan the Essex class. Where'd it go? Just four. Because I've got so many ships planned that by the time we start on those, we will probably be damn near to the next to the carrier fours so no biggie there we are suffering from low manpower and low political power. Great Depression thing still. We don't get rid of the Great Depression. Until here. Issue war bonds. And we have to be at war. With a major country. which I do not want to do. And I'll tell you why I want to knock out all of these little countries and take over the Americas. Because once we're at war with a major country, we know what happens. You have to deal with resistance until you get a treaty. I don't want to deal with resistance. surrounding us with air bases. Let's put one in Texas. Put that one up to the top. Pumping out those naval yards right now. 
And then we got military factories after that. Looking good. And we got the Cleveland class. Let's go for the Baltimore class. Definitely feel the urge to upgrade my cruisers. I'm willing to lose those days. Yes. What the hell? That's not what... Wait a minute now. Did it just go to the bottom? It just flat out disappeared. It just fucking disappeared. Those are all going to different destroyer flotillas. None of the flotillas are repeated. So it just flat out disappeared. That's great. It converted to a convoy. Here it is. Um, did I hit the convoys, guys? I don't remember hitting the convoys. I mean, that's weird. There we go, tanks. Just go to Pat. He needs you. Do a little bit of training. Why in the hell am I getting that order? Because I didn't have his whole army picked. Now let's try this. I'm still getting that. Okay, I'll pass. He's, they're almost... Never mind. I don't like threatening notes from assholes. Finland has capitulated. The USSR is on a roll. I hope I don't have to go to war with them before I'm ready. Oh man, our manpower is suffering. Production cap. Let's go after construction. And now we will just. Oh, I could do air support or strategic bombing. I won't do either one yet, to be honest. I'll just sit on that and wait. I need the political power points. I need to change my economy and change my conscription. We are ready for war. Are you ready for war? Hey, 
expires November 24th, 1941. So it expires quickly. Let's end this with war. Well, some of these battles aren't going too well for us. Combine all of these into another army. Give them a decent commander. He's an engineer. Okay, whatever. And send them all to there. We're losing ground against Mexico, guys. Let's slow this down so I can set a few things up here. Oh, there's only one there. Oh, there's got to be more than one. Yeah, there is two. Patton would not, well, he would shuffle his divisions around. Never mind. Gave Patton too broad of a front. That's my bad, not Patton's. No, I gave that. I did give that to you, too. Why aren't you moving your troops out there? straight into Mexico City, maybe undefended. Then recuperate. Patton's recovering nicely. Can't stay mad at him. And we are out of time, people. So we're going to have to come back to this next time. So until I see y'all next time, be sure to give this thumbs up.
Leave your comments and orders down below, sir. All is appreciated. The good, the bad, the ugly. And, of course, there should be a link popping up right about now, which will lead you to a subscriber of mine that has videos of their own posted. And until I see y'all again next time, bye bye